Okay, good morning. It's Saturday, and I promised my kids I was going to make them a big breakfast. And I'm going to use this waffle maker I got for Christmas that I never opened. So, we can open this bad baby up. Yeah. Okay, it's nice. It's real nice. And, you know, I'm kind of familiar with it. I used to work at IHOP for a long, long time. So, yeah, we finna get the IHOPping up in this bitch. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, let's plug it in. And we're going to turn it to a little... I don't know what degree to put it on, but we're going to put it somewhere so these are instructions this is a waffle and pancake mix i'm gonna make waffles of course i'm not a pancake type of bitch i'm a waffle kind of bitch you know so you're gonna add your water they said two cups of water they said a cup of um oil and you have to use two cups of the mixing powder i'm gonna make this and we're gonna mix this up i'm gonna pour a you know a good amount in there get it a test drive and see how it come out yeah that's enough that's enough that's enough. All right. Let's close it and flip it. And we're going to wait. Okay. I'll flip it. And we're going to wait for this green light to come on when it's ready. This pan, let's take it out. I ain't trying to make no mess. Put it under there. Okay. That thing ain't doing what it do. Yeah. Let's get to this bacon, though. Oh, my God. It's smoking, y'all. It got ready real fast. I couldn't even get to the bacon. But, yes. That turned out real good. Real nice. That's a good test. That's a good test one right there. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's get to this bacon though. I almost burnt this powder up. I forgot it was on over here because it be on waffle was in the part of Like, damn. But yeah, we're going to put this bacon in here and get this pork. Okay, mind the business. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we're going to spread this out. You know, this is what country people do. This rice has been soaking. We're going to put this in a pot. Just check on the waffle. Okay, all right. It's good. Put that rice in there. And we're going to put some water in there. We're going to let that boil do what it do. The first round of bacon is done. I done got three waffles out there. Stop playing with me. I am not one of them. Do not play with that girl. She is not one of them. Let's season and put some butter in this rice. I had to take the filter off so y'all can see. Okay, second batch of bacon. You know, let's put some unsalted butter in this skillet and start popping these eggs down. One. Ain't nobody break eggs like me. Here's two. No shell. Three. Yeah, no shell. Four, no shit. One hand. Stop playing. When I play with that girl, she is not one of them. Another hand, another one. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's mix this up. I guess they call this like the lazy egg mix, but I've always made my eggs like this. I don't never put in a bowl and mix them up. Like, that's just too many dishes. And ain't nobody got spoon for this. So yeah, after we get this a good mix, we gonna add some, um, some pepper, and we gonna add some um, pink salt to it. And we're gonna offer some cheese in it. Yeah, because you know you gotta have cheese in the eggs. Right. So we're gonna mix it up. Yeah, it ain't cheesy. If it ain't cheesy, what homegirls say, <laughs> it ain't easy if it ain't cheesy. But anyway, this is the finished result. I'm so proud of myself. It was my first using a waffle maker. So yeah, I had to take the filter off so y'all could see too. Cause, you know, for what? Filter for what? But no, I'm proud of myself. Look at these waffles. And then, you know, I had to get, you know, another plate made. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 